and it is face mask Friday. Oh, this week been so crazy, y'all. Oh my god, my birthday is coming up. This shit is getting wild, y'all. Okay, so two things on the Friday agenda we will be talking about. Jennifer Lawrence's trash ass. Stupid bitch. And Charlemagne the God being a coon ass nigga. Yes. Fuck you, Charlemagne. Fuck you. So we gonna get to the white girl last. Cause you know, maybe some of y'all heard about it. Or you know, I'm gonna just give y'all my fucking thoughts. But first, this was Charlemagne tweeted. He had a series of tweets. But this is the main one I wanna focus on because it pissed me off the most. Well, I shouldn't say that all of his tweets pissed me off. So would be dope if a young black or Hispanic woke woman used social media to create a platform to be a voice like Tommy Lauren did. He literally sat his ass up here and said, oh, I wish a black woman had a platform or used a platform as big as Tommy did. You literally compared women of color to a racist ass, white supremacist ass bitch. Like you really sat there and did that. Why are you and Trevor Noah sitting up here fighting for her little racist heart? Like what the fuck is this about? What is this? Oh my God. Like what is happening? Really Charlamagne? Really? Really? Should I be surprised? Absolutely not. No, because you always do shit like this. You always come out of left field and just run your fucking mouth and say some of the dumbest, most ignorant shit. Like, sometimes I feel like I can only take maybe 5 or 10% of you because the rest is just fucking noise. Like, honestly, what about Francesca Lee, Issa Rae, Ava DuVernay, Shonda Rhimes? Like, there are so many women... On YouTube and off of YouTube, directors, writers, producers, screenplay, come on! And you know, you know, you don't want to know why his um, fucking statement was bullshit. You know, if a black woman got the same platform that Tommy Lauren did, got her own fucking show because you know the racist hired her in so she could be the young racist voice and got all the other racists in there to drink for the pond of racist. God, fuck you, Charlemagne. But you know for a fact, if a black woman got the type of platform Tommy did, she would be the angry, loud black woman. She would be called ghetto, ignorant, a monkey, and all this other racist bullshit. So please spare me the you wish a woman of color would do something that Tommy doing. We are doing it. You just want to act like we don't fucking exist to make this bitch look good. Like, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? You wonder why people dog the shit out of you. I don't know how many more celebrities are going to come on your show if you talk this kind of shit. Honestly, how dare you? How dare you? Like, I'm not surprised at all. But seriously, how can you be so fucking ignorant? And then be like, well, what should they do? Like, really? Fuck you, Charlemagne. That shit is so crazy. You are just shucking and jiving your ass off for this bitch, ain't you? Don't give the day yourself, motherfucker. Like, you so ignorant. Oh, my God. Whoo, child. Leave us alone. Leave black women alone. Every time y'all think of some dumb shit to bash us with or come at us sideways, don't. Just don't. Like, leave all your ignorant ass comments, especially you black men out there that be fucking cooning it the fuck up for these white bitches who don't even consider y'all people in the first place because of the color of your fucking skin. Leave us the fuck alone. Damn. Black women don't go out of their way to say fucked up shit about black men on TV all the time. No, we don't. But y'all do all of the time. Ain't you tired? Because fuck, I'm tired. Damn! <sighs> Shit. Another thing. Jennifer fucking Lawrence. This stupid cow. Okay. Oh my god. 
So she was on the Graham Norton show with Chris Pratt and somebody else, I forgot the actor's name that was on stage, and she told this story how they were shooting in Hawaii and how there was this island that had these sacred rocks that was near her trailer and a lot of the movie she was wearing a wetsuit so her ass got itchy. So you want to know what this bitch did? Scratched her ass on sacred rocks. Jennifer Lawrence, white, ignorant, privileged ass, just said, hey, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to scratch my ass on some rocks that are considered sacred to the people in the town. Because you know why? I don't give a fuck. How are you this fucking rude? No, I know how you this fucking rude. Because Hollywood, like, ram their heads up your ass so fucking fast to where you think your shit don't stink. And nobody sits and tells you that this shit is not cute. And it's not fucking funny. You're not hilarious. You're really not. Hell, Chris Pratt looked uncomfortable. You're not funny. This isn't cute. I don't know if Amy Schumer told you that this would be a cute story to tell on fucking television, but it's fucking offensive. Then she says in the story how she was scratching her ass so hard on a rock one day that she caused another rock to come flying down a hill, almost killed somebody that's working on a movie, and the locals said, it's the curse, it's the curse. And then she makes a joke going, huh, the curse is me and my ass. Why do you think shit like that is cute, Jennifer Lawrence? Did you honor, first of all, why do you think that you're so fucking special and just so aloof to other people's practices and things that they keep sacred in their hearts to where you want to fucking desecrate it by rubbing your ass on it? Why did you fix it in your brain to do that ignorant shit? Then tell a story about it on TV as if it was cute, girl. I'm so fucking tired of you. I am so tired of you. Hollywood acts like you're this golden fucking girl who makes all these great movies when you literally do movies with the same fucking people every fucking time. How many more movies with you and Bradley Cooper do we need, Jennifer? Oh, you bitch is so exhausting. You got one fucking job. Make a movie, entertain me, go your ass in the house. Oh, and don't fuck with sacred land and sacred rocks that should not be touched, you ignorant bitch. Oh my God. <sighs> Charlemagne can suck all the dicks. Like you just one of them other ignorant ass black men who loves to go out of his way to bash black women because you hate us. Shut your fucking lips. We don't ask for shit from you, Charlemagne. Shut the fuck up. And Jennifer Lawrence, please, please pull your head out your ass, sweetheart, because this fame shit will fade. You can make one wrong step, one wrong movie, and Hollywood will tell you to go fuck yourself so fucking quick. You're not Meryl Streep. Chill out. <sighs> y'all wonder why I smoke weed. Shit like this, y'all. Whew. That's it for Face Mask Friday. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Tell me what you thought in the comments about Charlemagne's ignorant ass black women, Hispanic women, women of color rant on Twitter. And tell me if you've seen the clip of Jennifer Lawrence and Chris Pratt on the Graham Norton show where she tells that disgusting and disrespectful ass story. I hope you all have a safe, fun weekend. And like I say at the end of every video, if no one's told you that you're awesome and that they love you, I think you're awesome and I love you. Peace!